They are some of the most terrifying images from the fires. Desperate people rushing into the ocean, the only way to escape the flames. We're in the ocean. We're in the ocean. 19 year old Noah Tompkinson was one of them. <laughs> Along with his 13 year old brother, Milo. You're going to be okay, Milo. Okay. And their mother. Both sides, to the left and the right, are on fire. White smoke starting to come, which means the fire is starting to die. How did the idea to run into the ocean, how did that even happen? We kind of had it in the back of our mind the whole time that we wanted to be next to the water. If things got really bad, we could, you know, save ourselves by jumping into the ocean. And that, that is what it came to. If we walked across the street, we would have been, like, we would have been in the fire. Emil, what were you thinking, man? You're like a little guy, and you've seen all this craziness in front of you. What was that like? I was just trying to survive. Like, I was just in survival mode. That's it. The three waiting in the water for hours. Did it get to any point, Milo, where you were, like, kind of scared, like, when are we going to get rescued? Yeah, because they were taking, like, a really long time because they couldn't get to us because all the cars were blocked off. So we were kind of just trapped in the ocean. I didn't think we were going to get rescued. I thought we were going to have to wait till daylight and then swim out more and towards safety. Despite his fears, Noah kept the family calm. Jimmy, okay. Don't look at the fire. Don't look. Look this way. This is good. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. They waited there well into the night, the flames burning on land just beyond them. And when their mother started getting too cold... There was one point where we kind of, like, all huddled around her and just wanted to, like, keep her warm. We kept, like, rubbing her arms, just, like, trying to keep, create some warmth for her. Has your mom talked to you guys and, and thanked you for being by her side, or...? We didn't save her. She also saved us. Like, if, if any of us were alone, I don't know if we would have made it. It was the fact that all, all of us were together that, that helped us the most. Just one of the families here in Maui, it shows you the resilience of the people here. And Noah tells me he doesn't want to leave Lahaina. He wants to be here as it rebuilds to help the people on this island. And Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.